the go. West Michigan's news leader is 24 Hour News 8. First to a developing story on the lakeshore this evening, a car found charred, a burned body just feet away. Tonight, investigators are searching for clues in southern Allegan County. They're working to positively identify the victim found in the 300 block of 74th Street. 24-Hour News 8's Leon Hendricks has been on the scene all evening. He joins us live now with the latest. Leon? Emily, good evening. This is the crime scene. You can see it's still wrapped in crime tape. That is a burned out spot. That is where investigators found the vehicle. We're told it was just feet from that, that the body was found. Now, over this way, you can see there is a sheriff's department vehicle. That vehicle is going to be stationed there all night. Investigators will be back on the scene this morning, hoping that the daylight might help them find some more clues into this death investigation. So I can't determine if it's a homicide or not right now. It's a quiet time of the year in an area where many of the homes are rented by summertime vacationers. Now the scene of a death investigation. We haven't determined who the body was so or who the car comes back to. Found down there, 74th Street, where the road dead ends, an investigation began. Around noon, investigators say, neighbors noticed a burned out car. Investigators found a body close by. They say it too was burned. Last time I was down there was last night, probably about 9 o'clock at night. I was having to go down the street and turn around. There was nothing down there at 9 o'clock last night. Fred Kick, one of the few that calls this home year-round, but one of the many wanting to know what happened just down the road. Something obviously caught fire, but no one noticed it until after it was out. With no wind or anything, it would be funny that no one would smell any smoke or anything. And I talked with some of the neighbors, and no one really realized there was anything amiss at all. The car whisked away, covered with a tarp so badly burned investigators couldn't make out a plate number. It's a key piece of an investigation, and it's very early stages. So it's a cul-de-sac, quiet neighborhood, and you know, virtually no crime at all around here at all. So it's, it's pretty serious when something like this happens. Again, this investigation is still very much open. It will continue through the night. We, of course, will pass along any new information that comes in overnight on 24-hour news 8 daybreak in the morning. The Sheriff's Department asking anyone with information on what may have happened here to give them a call. Reporting live in southern Allegan County, Leon Hendricks, 24-hour news 8.